All of my life, I've been taught to follow my dreams and chase big things. And I was given this paper that was blank on both sides, eagerly awaiting to have a story written inside. So I quickly grabbed my pen and I went in, decided what I wanted and decided what I didn't. Decided what I wanted in my life, even if I didn't need it. And after living the life that I had written, I noticed that there was something missing. But how? I had it all. I wrote it down, so I had to have it. Is that not how it works? I'm supposed to be in control. The universe is here at my disposal. I'm just doing me. So I would write again to fill the missing piece. Searching my brain for a piece of peace. Hoping it would calm me down. As my world around was getting twisted upside down, I don't understand. I see no errors written by my hand. I wrote the perfect life. Oh, but don't worry about the scratched out spots. That's where I changed my mind. But as this life keeps rolling, I find myself back at the table. Grabbing my pen, grip tight, holding on, asking myself, what am I going to write? When I don't see any hope in sight, my country is slowly failing, the moral values are also fading, my job sucks, I work all day, I break my back just to get paid. Is there more to this? Is there a bigger picture? Because these words I had written shown that I've put myself in a prison. A mental lock of strict human desires chasing the pleasures of flesh as my life slowly expires. But I thank God because in my search for a missing piece, I opened a door that burst open with peace. Almost swept me off my feet, so I held on tight because I knew this might be a one time delight, but to my surprise, it wasn't. So I kept coming back, I felt the need to talk, to ask questions. What is this? Who are you? God, is this you? Is this what you're like? Because I have this unbelievably good feeling inside. If in fact it is you, what do I need to sustain this peace? What is it that you want from me? See, there is no booming voice. Crazy experience. Just my eyes locking with my design, the perfect life that I had in mind. I had written it down, remember? God, you want my paper? Is that the missing piece? Have I been approaching this paper wrong this entire time? My questions took me deeper, finding out that there is something clearer. And he goes by the name of Jesus. drown it in his blood for he is a true savior and as his blood drips off my old paper in my amazement I see my writing is gone he took all my failures and ideas and he wiped them clean because he knows that a life without him is a life that is incomplete God you know what I give you my pen please take it I'd rather have my life be written by the mastermind of humankind and if he can make this world, then he can have mine. I have only one hope inside. Is that you see that he can and will rewrite yours in time.